everybody, and welcome to Are You Kidding Me?, where we cover the ridiculous and the funny in the NFL. Let's get started. So, LeGarrette Blunt, uh, a backup running back for the Pittsburgh Steelers, left the game early in the Steelers' Monday night game against the Titans. Are you kidding me? He left the game early because he was upset because he didn't get a single carry. Boo-hoo. That's not what a teammate does. That's not what a professional does. And he left the game early. By the time the rest of the team got to the locker room, he was already dressed and showered. Oh, well, look at me. I'm all done. Well, I just... This is such selfish, baby-like behavior. And guess what? He got his because the Steelers released him. And now he's out of a job. And I don't know what team would pick him up, but uh, I would advise caution against anybody thinking about it. All right, so Ahmad Brooks, running back for the 49ers, took himself out of the game in the second quarter. He wasn't injured. He just took himself out of the game. Are you kidding me? Again with the selfish baby-like behavior. You want to know why he took himself out of the game? Oh, he was upset because he was going to have to split his time with Eldon Smith and Lynch. So he was just a big fat baby about it. And he went and he sat on the bench and he had his helmet on. He took his cleats off and cut his ankle tape off. And he's like, no, I'm healthy. You're just being a baby, a big, fat baby. And you know what? The 49ers haven't released him, but guess what? I would advise you guys to release him. You don't need that kind of crap in your locker room, and you don't need that crap on the field. You need players that are going to work for you, players that feel like it is a privilege to have a job in this game. I mean, how many people would kill to have their job be in the NFL, okay? I mean, lots of people. I mean, look at the running back for the Patriots. He sat on the practice squad. They finally called him up in October. And what does Jonas Gray do? He rushes for 201 yards and four touchdowns on Sunday. Those are the kind of people you need on your team. Not these selfish babies who like to call themselves men and professionals at that. So get rid of them. Oh, stupid people. All right. And our last one comes from a, um, it's about a fan. So, Jermaine Gresham, and the Bengals are playing the Saints, scored a touchdown. He t clearly was tossing the ball to a Bengals fan. She was wearing a Bengals jersey. There was a Saints fan sitting next to her. And when Jermaine Gresham threw the ball up, he, like, went in front of her and grabbed the ball and refused to give it back to her. Are you kidding me? What is with it? Why are people so mean? Why are people just, oh, they're so mean. And she was like, can you please give me the ball? And you can see her. She's like pleading with him, and he refused. People were like, oh, well, he did it so he could give it to his eight-year-old grandson. I don't care. Wrong is wrong. Wrong is wrong. And fortunately, she got a ball anyway, and Jermaine Gresham said on his Twitter feed that he would make it up to her and that he was sorry. But Jermaine Gresham doesn't need to be sorry. That Saints fan needs to be sorry. People being all mean and rude. Man, get some manners. Oh. All right. That's it for this week's Are You Kidding Me? If you have anything you'd like me to cover, you can tweet me at PetsFangirl12. Please go to Gridiron Girl's Twitter at GridironGirlOrg or visit GridironGirl.org. Have a great day, everybody.